Oak Crest here in Parkville. Nice craftsman style house here. Can't really see the roof. Windows look good. This is our driveway right here. Smallish backyard, similar to uh, everybody else. It looks like, yeah, those are townhouses behind us, actually. Uh, okay, it's a smallish backyard. It looks like we have a nice deck here with a hot tub. That's kind of cool. So, plenty of room to entertain, but a little small. A little shed back here as well. Yeah, deck solid. porch Piece of condition. walk in stairs to the right living room dining room to the left baseboard then drywall Living room right here is 15-7. Now into the dining room. 13-3. 13, 13 by 13-2, dining room. Baseboard, drywall. Radiator. It's the kitchen. I think we just knock that wall out and just open up the whole living room, dining room, kitchen. That's what we need to do. Open this whole thing up. The kitchen measures out at 13.5. And 13.5 and 11.8 for the kitchen measures out as. Right here. Walking back here, full bath. Uh, with a shower. Not a tub, with a shower. Huh, towel looks really decent actually. Might leave that. Over here, a little closet of some sort. So, from the back out to the hot tub and the deck. Let's go upstairs. Bedroom number one, windows are good. Tile ceilings, drywall and trim, but tile ceilings.
the measurement of this room. 12, 5, 11, 10. Bedroom number 2. Tile ceilings as well. Drywall and trim. Radiator. This is 12, 6. At 14, 2. Shit. Third bedroom. 12, 8. This has drywall ceilings. Looks like there's a little water damage right there. So this is all drywall and trim. Radiators. So that was 12, 8. Windows are good. 12 8 by 11 4. So three decent sized bedrooms. A full bath, single vanity. Everybody's sharing up here. Baseboard. Hit the basement. Basement has drop ceilings. I'm going to measure from the joist here. Seven foot ceilings from the joists. Um, let's get a measurement of the basement. 21 2. 21 2 by 23 5 is the full footprint. Um, looks like there's some, I don't know what's going on here. Drop down some lights. What's going on up there? So there's baseboard down here and concrete floor. One hundred amp service. Square D load center. So we need eights back. It's the hot water heater. And wow, look at that. This has been waterproofed. Woo woo! Waterproof. That's always cool. So this is kind of like the utility room. We can make this a bedroom right here. This area a bedroom with the window right there. And then we would have a decent size um, family area here, but we would have that block kind of in the middle of it. But uh, we're actually, we could probably do this, the, the bedroom, and that way this is more of a family room over here. And then squeeze a bath in somewhere, it might be tight. 